Just watching the pole vault. And not interested. That's a bad jump, huh, dude. <laughs> This week was not as exciting as last week, but uh, we'll see how it goes. 500 views in a week on my last video. I guess people like me doing stupid all the time, so. Oh, keep giving me what you want. Uh, vault stuff. Tuesday, I vaulted from four lefts again. Still trying to make movement of swinging uh, my right knee to my right hand. I want it to be automatic. Uh, we had the crossbar at 490, which is 16-1 had some pretty good shots at it. Uh, my hips were pretty high. It's coming along. It's still not 100%. I would say it's around 70. So that's good. Progress is always a plus. Uh, Friday, I went back to six lefts again. Six lefts went pretty well for feeling super flat and not very poppy off the ground. Um, we had the crossbar at five meters, which is like around 16.6, somewhere around there and uh, it was looking good. I'm just trying to get from what I can do from four lefts to my six. So sometimes I hit it, sometimes I don't. Uh, when I do hit it, it works so good and uh, there's a pike in there which I've never had. So I'm excited. It's only my third day at six lefts and it's going better than it ever has. Kind of ready for a rest week. I'm gonna train lightly through next week so I can take Christmas as my rest week. I think it's just me, but I got this new attachment for my GoPro, and I've been having a lot of fun sneaking up on people. Like I said, training this cycle has been hard. One more set of frog hops. I hate frog hops. Plyos twice a week. Weights three times a week. Vaulting twice a week. And then, like, really fast 200s. Twice a week. Uh, I'm just gonna start cutting back just a little bit. Start with some 150s for the runs. Weights will still be heavy, but I'm gonna take plyos out and try to do treadmill workout again the next six weeks. So the next two cycles, I'll be... Trying to not fly off the back of the treadmill. So we'll see how that goes too. Today is my birthday. This time of the year always kind of makes me reflect. Nothing ever goes the way you've planned. I look back and I have a master's degree now and I don't have a job. I'm pretty much using up all my savings to pole vault, doing some camps to try and make some money so I can do this a little longer. And uh, it's hard, but for the first time, I think in my life I'm doing something that I want to do instead of things I thought other people expected me and wanted me to do. I feel good about it, but it's scary at the same time. I want to I wanna see what I can do with this pole vault thing, so that's what I'm doing. I have the rest of my life to work. Well, eventually I'll get a job somewhere. Don't want to right now. Doesn't sound like fun. I'm having way more fun pole vaulting and meeting all sorts of new people. Yeah, I've always been kind of against the grain type of person, so I am happy to be going against the grain and chasing what I enjoy and love doing. Life's too short to be doing anything else. Maybe that's my words of wisdom for the week. Do what makes you happy. Life's too short. Oh, since it's my birthday, I got a couple presents. Wenches love me. Wenches love me. Oh, I also added an ornament to my tree. Owl themes. It's just gonna, it's gonna be following me forever now. I named him Eddie. Eddie the owl. Hoot! 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 Hoot!
So I got up this morning, bright and early, to go do some underwater pole vaulting. It was not open. We waited 45 minutes, pounding on the glass, nobody let us in. Bree and Katie showed up, so all three of us were sitting there, and I asked what their favorite Christmas movie was, because I watched three of them yesterday. My favorite Christmas movie is It's a Wonderful Life, by the way. So Bree goes, I like The Grinch! The one with Jim Carrey! And then she proceeded to go do a scene <laughs> from the movie. Doubt! Another unmistakable sign of the heebie-jeebies! No! And I almost fell on the floor. I was laughing so hard. And since it's my birthday, overwhelmed again. Just text messages and Facebook posts and Team Nodak kids making collages of learning how to vault. I got a video from two, two of my fellow Nodakers. Sean, it's your birthday today. I am driving, talking, texting, and videoing at the same time. How do you like me now? Also, if it looks like I'm wearing like a fur collar, I am. But anyway, be expecting another sweet vid later tonight, a la me and the boo smooch. Happy birthday! I don't know what to say. It leaves me speechless. I, I, it makes me feel so good that there's people like this in my life, and I'm surrounded by a lot of positive amazing people so thank you for all the wishes and thank everyone for all the support they've been giving me thus far like always please subscribe share these with your friends pole vault camp a week from friday the 27th and 28th and then after the 28th and 29th and 30th we'll have open pole vault so like 25 bucks a kid come in and jump and i'll be there and coach whatever you want i'll watch whatever you want uh, might be jumping with you guys too if you want me to. So, looking forward to that. I'll see you guys later. Random garbage of the week. We have a lot of animals at my house. We have a bird, and she says all sorts of crazy things. Hey, rooster. What are you doing? I don't even know what you're saying anymore. What? I don't get it. What? Tickle, tickle, tickle. Tickle, 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 My little brother Kyle has a dog named Gizmo. He's really small, and we're afraid he's gonna get frost bite when he was in Fargo, so we put these boots on him. Gizmo doesn't like the boots, so I'm gonna end with that today. Gizmo wearing his boots. Good boy! Tug. Tug. Seriously, I'm excited for the camp.